I told y'all, look, I just completed day three. Good morning, world. Let's see what's going on today. This is day three. I finally finished day three. Oh my gosh. All right, that's the official number. Don't count me out. I'm still here. As I told you all, the most that I've ever gone in my life without eating was three days until now. I am in a new space and I've only drunk water for the last three and a half days. How am I feeling? Hunger wise, my hunger is up to about a five respectfully about a five right now my energy level <laughs> is down to about a five as well now it's starting to really kick in i'm really starting to feel a little bit more lethargic i felt a lot more brain for uh as i said yesterday i felt a lot more brain fog it took me some moments to start to gather my thoughts i was like wait what, what was i talking about i had those kind of moments and i think that was a direct correlation to you know the, the challenge. <laughs> Even right now, I'm still a little tired. So it, it's starting to really show its its, 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 its uh, teeth, this whole challenge thing. But the good news is we we in the final couple of days. You know, you really become one with yourself. And I didn't expect that. When you don't really have food to rely on, because if you think about it, most of the time you're thinking about what you're going to eat, what you're going to drink. If you think about it, ha like most of your day revolves around food. If you really think about it, you're always thinking about what you're going to eat, when the last time you ate, when you got to pee or used to do a number two from what you ate, it's all, like your whole life revolves around food. So when you remove food from the equation, especially for this long, you start to realize that, you know, you become more in tune with your thoughts and your thoughts become what feeds you in a lot of ways. You know, just thinking and thinking and reflecting, I'm, I'm starting to wonder like, what can I do? What can I change? What can I, how can I be a better person? These are the thoughts you have when there's nothing else to distract you in terms of food. And some of my revelations was take a break. You know, after this Monday, I'm gonna drop a new video from my Limits to Mercy album. And you know, I'm gonna just take a month off and just be with my family and build up my businesses. These are the things that you start to think about and you realize that you're missing when you're without food. Here we are. Day four, I, I feel good. I, I don't feel like I'm gonna break down at any point. Your man Rick the Dawn checking out. I'll be back in a minute. All right, here I go. Um, last time I checked, I was 216. And you can start to see slight pectoral action happening here from the side view. Definitely starting to shape back up <laughs> after a, a really, really funny start. But yeah, you can see the body starting to transform a little bit. I'm not sure if you can see it through the filter, but you still got two full days left. So we'll see what happens. Yo, what's going on? Oh man, it's a uh, one o'clock Saturday. I'm about 11 hours from completing day four. I feel so bad because I'm not helping with like the kids and stuff like that. I'm not quitting. I'm not in that space mentally. I still feel like I can keep going. Like I said, I've never gone this far before, but we'll see what happens. I'm still hanging in there. I'm not giving up. We'll see what happens. Mm -hmm. 